hey you guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is a little different this is me like doing a video idea that i've been thinking about doing but kind of i was low-key holding off because i didn't know how well this video would do my channel but i honestly don't care um and another disclaimer is this is just me telling you my experience and my story and what i went through personally and hopefully you know i like i like watching these kind of videos why well, i used to like watching these kind of videos so i was like why not tell like people what i've been through my experience and all that good stuff and honestly if you're here to judge or any of that then you can go like just click the x button yeah and i'm the type of person where i don't tell none of my business so this is a lot for me like this is a lot i'm about to tell you guys this story and we're gonna know each other like we're gonna be best friends <laughs> after this video okay yeah as you guys can see by the title i'm gonna be telling you guys how i lost my virginity or my v card or whatever you want to call it before we actually get into this video my eyebrows are not done <laughs> they look so rough i know i'm not wearing no makeup i did not feel like doing my makeup today <clears throat> but uh, before we get into this video don't forget to comment down below like an emoji or something uh, don't forget to subscribe if this is your first time ever like watching me welcome to my channel don't forget to subscribe right there it literally takes like two seconds this 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 this, this video Am I ready? Okay guys, so I'm gonna try to make the, short, the story as short as possible. All right, so it all began, um, it was my senior year in high school. Um, was I 18? Okay, this is another disclaimer. I suck at telling stories. This is why I don't have as many story times on my channel, but I have so many stories. So we're going to get through this together. And if I do good, let me know. I can. I have so many, so many much more funny stories, you guys. Like crazy stories too, because I be doing a whole lot of, a whole lot of hood rat shit. But um, yeah, so this goes back to, what was the year? I think the year was 2016 because I graduated that year. Okay, so it was back and right before i graduated we graduated in G may or june and i lost my virginity in april i'm trying to figure out this happened in april about like two months before i graduated high school i did lose my virginity when i was 17 but i turned 18 like the next month that doesn't really matter i was graduating high school at the time and i don't know i had always I don't know all throughout high school like middle school i was not worried about like doing the nasty or none of that um i was like an innocent little kid my parents were really strict so i like barely went out um when i did i always got in trouble like i stayed in trouble i stayed in the house like crazy right i know i don't even i was a bad kid but um so yeah uh 2016 like was a crazy year for me like I was a while then you guys um so yeah I always said like whenever I lost my virginity I wanted to have a boyfriend I don't want it to be like some random guy I wanted to do it like how it was supposed to happen not saying that if you lost your virginity like and he wasn't your boyfriend then it's all wrong like honestly it don't really matter because we're not even together now but when I started talking to my ex like my most recent ex we dated for a long time and i was like wow like he actually might be the guy that i am gonna lose my virginity to so i always had that in the back of my head but never really like i don't know so we have started talking i will say like december of 2015 um and we talked from december january february <clears throat> and march he asked me out in march and then I didn't lose my virginity until April and then graduated in May and then it was like 2k16 summer so that's how it worked so we talked for three months he asked me out and then I lost my virginity so we had always been talking about it you know joking around about it and stuff like that and I don't know I was just like ready you know how like all throughout high school and middle school I was not thinking about this shit but I got my first boyfriend and now I was like oh wow like it's gonna happen this is how it was meant to happen and all that simp 
shit. How it actually happened was um, my best my best friend at the time, uh, we actually don't talk anymore, but my best friend at the time, um, I want to say we had like, uh, we used to always stay after school. I want to say like it was, maybe I had like cheer practice or something because I was not supposed to be there. But I remember she was actually, she actually dropped me off over his house. Um, and I just remember like the whole car ride over there. I was so nervous. I was so, so nervous. I was, where was I supposed to be? I don't even know. Where the hell was I supposed to be? Because not over there. I feel like I was supposed to be staying after school for something. And then like we got out early or something. I She drove me over there. And then he took me to work because I remember I had to go to work right after. So yeah, uh, I remember the whole time in the car, we smoked. And this is when I first started smoking. So our dumbasses, we were smoking out of like a water bottle, you know, with the foil on top. And you, <laughs> you put the weed and the foil on top and then you light it. Yeah, we were some crackheads back in the day. But uh, I remember I had smoked out of that fucking water bottle. And I didn't even get that high, to be honest. And I was like, okay, I'm ready. I lucky think it was raining. Um, and I just remember pulling up to his house. I was so nervous. And she was like, bitch, get out of my car. Um, okay, so that was the drive to his house. So when I got there, um, wow, this is so crazy. Cause this is such a long time ago. So when I got there, um, I just remember we were just chilling on his bed. At this point, I was com comfortable like around him just because we had been talking for so long. That's another good thing that I liked that I did. I waited, like we were talking for a minute and then I lost my virginity to him, not just like boom, 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 you know? So yeah, I was pretty comfortable around him. Um, And honestly, I don't even remember how it happened. We didn't really, we low key did plan it. Oh my gosh, how did I think about it? Cause like, we both knew like this day we were gonna have sex. That's low key awkward, but why the fuck did I do that? But it, it was like planned, but not really planned. So, but planned, if that makes sense. So like we both knew whenever he opened the door and whenever I came, we knew like we are today. <laughs> it's crazy. Cause I thought that me and that nigga was gonna be together forever. Okay. So um, when I got there, we were just chilling watching movies and stuff. And then we were just like cuddling and stuff and like kissing. And then we both knew it was going down. So, and by the way, I don't know if I said this earlier. This was my first time doing everything. Actually, my first time having sex, I did not like. So, that happened like a different day. I don't even remember when that happened. I just remember he put out his little box of uh, condoms. And he put it on and it like when we started intercourse for a minute okay so pause 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 let's go back 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 so when i lost my virginity like when his when you know when we did it um it was really uncomfortable it was really really uncomfortable i do remember it being very uncomfortable it just felt like a lot of pressure i don't know this is so awkward how do people tell this like it took me a lot to get on here to come tell you guys this because oh i'm gonna regret this um it just felt like a lot of pressure, honestly. Not so much pain. I don't know. I don't. I wouldn't say that it hurt, cause I wasn't in pain. But it was just uncomfortable to where it's like, mm -mm. like I remember having to be like, okay, pause, hold on, like let me like get my life together. <laughs> um. Okay. And I do remember we did use a condom the first time, and it actually broke. It actually fucking broke. Uh. Yeah it broke so <laughs> since this was my boyfriend this sounds so bad I always use protection but after it broke we were just like well you don't have to use it and we didn't use it and the first time we actually like had sexual intercourse for a long time because I thought like your first time was supposed to be like one and done like you know in and out I didn't think my body was capable of like having sex i don't know this is so weird but yeah we actually had sex for a long time i remember just laying there thinking like wow oh my gosh <laughs> i really did this i really did this and then after 
I remember I was just I had to go to work so I just started getting ready for work the car ride when he took me to work was just like I love you <laughs> I'm so dead but um I was just feeling like a brand new bitch and I went to work like I was a manager no, I'm just kidding uh that was pretty much it um I waited a long time to lose my I would say I don't know if that's a long time a lot of people that I know lost their virginity when they were younger than what I was and I lost mine so I consider that to be a long time like when I was 18 I lost my virginity when I was 18 or about to turn 18 I think I was 17 about to turn 18 because I was I turned 18 right before I graduated because oh when I turned 18 shit like all hell broke loose I I, I like the way it happened and everything I have no complaints because you know how girls would be like oh then again shit like I, I wish I would have never I regret it blah 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 like I was cool we ended up dating for like four years so i don't regret nothing i don't regret it um but yeah i just want y'all to know sex changes everything like everything so if you're still a virgin stay one but yeah that was my little how i lost my v card hella random i don't know whoever's watching this if you know me like um so awkward i'm so so awkward you guys but i wanted to i'm starting i want to start putting new video, videos up on my channel and not just smoke sessions because i'm pretty freaking funny and i have a whole bunch of story times like a whole bunch of story times and i just need to get better at telling a story so i'm trying to get out of that shell right now but yeah um if you guys like this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and comment down below more video ideas that you want to see from me and i'll see you guys in my next video bye